Israel traveled with all that he had and came to Beersheba, and offered sacrifices to the God of his father Isaac. God spoke to Israel in the visions of the night and said, Jacob, Jacob. He said, Here I am. He said, I am God, the God of your father. Don't be afraid to go down into Egypt, for there I will make of you a great nation. I will go down with you into Egypt. I will also surely bring you up again. Joseph will close your eyes. Jacob rose up from Beersheba, and the sons of Israel carried Jacob their father, their little ones and their wives, and the wagons which Pharaoh had sent to carry him. They took their cattle and their goods, which they had gotten in the land of Canaan, and came into Egypt, Jacob and all his seed with him, his sons and his sons' sons with him, his daughters and his sons' daughters, and he brought all his seed with him into Egypt. These are the names of the children of Israel who came into Egypt, Jacob and his sons, Reuben, Jacob's firstborn, the sons of Reuben, Hanak, Palu, Hezron, and Carmi, the sons of Simeon, Jemuel, Jamin, Ohad, Jachin, Zohar, and Shaul, the son of a Canaanite woman, the sons of Levi, Gershon, Kohath, and Merari, the sons of Judah, Ur, Onan, Shelah, Perez, and Zerah. But Er and Onan died in the land of Canaan. The sons of Perez were Hezron and Hamul. The sons of Issachar, Tola, Puva, Iob, and Shimron. The sons of Zebulun, Sered, Elan, and Shalil. These are the sons of Leah, whom she bore to Jacob in Padan Aram, with his daughter Dinah. All the souls of his sons and his daughters were thirty-three. The sons of Gad, Ziphion, Hagi, Shunai, Esbon, Irai, Arodai, and Arelai. The sons of Asher, Imna, Ishva, Ishvi, Bariah, and Serah their sister. The sons of Bariah, Eber, and Malkiel. These are the sons of Zilpah, whom Laban gave to Leah, his daughter, and these she bore to Jacob, even sixteen souls. The sons of Rachel, Jacob's wife, Joseph and Benjamin. To Joseph in the land of Egypt were born Manasseh and Ephraim, whom Ashenath, the daughter of Potiphera, priest of On, bore to him. The sons of Benjamin, Bela, Becher, Ashbel, Gira, Naaman, Ehi, Rosh, Mupim, Hupim and Ard. These are the sons of Rachel who were born to Jacob. All the souls were fourteen. The son of Dan, Hushim. The sons of Naphtali, Jazil, Gunai, Jezer, and Shilim. These are the sons of Bilhah, whom Laban gave to Rachel his daughter, and these she bore to Jacob. All the souls were seven. All the souls who came with Jacob into Egypt, who were his direct descendants besides Jacob's sons' wives, all the souls were sixty-six. The sons of Joseph, who were born to him in Egypt, were two souls. All the souls of the house of Jacob, who came into Egypt, were seventy. He sent Judah before him to Joseph, to show the way before him to Goshen, and they came into the land of Goshen. Joseph made ready his chariot and went up to meet Israel, his father, in Goshen. He presented himself to him and fell on his neck and wept on his neck a good while. Israel said to Joseph, Now let me die, since I have seen your face, that you are still alive. Joseph said to his brothers and to his father's house, I will go up and speak with Pharaoh and will tell him, My brothers and my father's house, who are in the land of Canaan, have come to me. These men are shepherds, for they have been keepers of cattle, and they have brought their flocks and their herds and all that they have. It will happen when Pharaoh summons you, and will say, What is your occupation? That you shall say, Your servants have been keepers of cattle from our youth, even until now, both we and our fathers, that you may dwell in the land of Goshen. For every shepherd is an abomination to the Egyptians.'